Dr. Fauci, you are about to testify in front of the Senate about the status of reopening the country. What do you need to align in your energetic body as you prepare to testify? Let's take a look and see. What do you, Dr. Fauci, need to align in your energetic body before you testify these next few days, next couple of days before the Senate? First thing, your sacral chakra. How are you in touch with, um, I know this is sexuality, but remember your sacral chakra, Dr. Fauci, is your home of um, creativity your home of emotions and emotional balance, also your house of uh, pleasure seeking. So how are you with openness and sharing right now and honor? So while this is sexuality, keep in mind, this again has a lot more to do with um, being open with how you feel, um, openly sharing and communicating, okay? There's that. Next, we have the money card. Uh, let's keep this in mind as you're testifying about the state of uh, whether to open up. Is this your testimony driven behind money and making sure you're fulfilling the need to get the people that you serve back to work or the peoples you serve back to work to restore the economy? So think of it that way. Divine consciousness interconnection, expansion, oneness. Again, here we go with openness and oneness and light. Are you um, seeking divine truth and spiritual connection before you speak and testify? Okay. How in tune are you with spirit before you speak and testify? And last but not least, here's our beautiful golden retriever. I call him Ruff Ruff. Talking about love, Ruff Ruff wants you to make sure that when you're speaking, your heart is aligned with kindness, benevolence, sharing, and receiving. Okay? So from a chakra perspective, work on your sacral chakra. Make sure, uh, work on your crown chakra, connection to universe, and work on your heart chakra. Um, align those and you'll be just fine. And you'll do fine by the people's you serve instead of the people you serve. All right, guys, until the next video, take care of yourself so we can take care of others so we can collectively take care of Mama Earth because she needs us right now. Bye, guys.